All right, so this is uh, the eighth video here in this series from a time I ever bought a storage auction. It's kind of fun. We got that pile of boxes. It's probably two videos. This stuff's all gone through. Let's get a box and find all the gold. It says miscellaneous. What do we have? That is a Canada flag. This is uh, another flag. That is. Leather bag. It's a nice leather bag. Nothing in it. Unfortunately, what else do we have? A little owl, some kid gloves, carpet, basically. There's a little rug. And oh, there's one of those Russian doll things, part of one. A shell necklace. There was a huge pile of jewelry in one of the other videos that we found. There's a couple of hats, like women's uh, summer hat kind of thing. Yeah. That's nice, my daughter will like that. For the tooth fairy, oh, look at that. It's a tooth fairy thing for the tooth yeah. fairy. This is pretty good. My daughter's seven, she's just losing her teeth. Here's a, here's a skipping rope. Oh, that's not a skipping rope. What is this? Mini gym, some kind of, oh, it's, maybe it's a skipping rope, I don't know. Uh, what else, there's not much else in here. Ooh, that's cool. Does it wind up? Little ballerina thing. My daughter will love this, she takes ballet. Pound puppies, newborns. Pound puppies, I remember those. There's the pound puppies, who remembers the pound puppies? Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you like uh, th this string of videos here. I'm gonna put all this stuff away. But uh, hopefully, with any luck, we'll have lots of subscribers and I'll be able to uh, get some more treasure. I wanna go gold panning. I don't know about buying more storage auctions, it was kind of fun. I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do with all this stuff. I think I'll have, a, have to have a big yard sale. But let's open another box. I know uh, there's one box of toys and one, some transformer fell out of it. Uh, I don't know where that is, but I haven't found it again. Oh, this is a box of books, definitely. Dried flower, perfect for the garden. There's a little turtle. World Book of Math Power. Easter eggs, is it money? It's a pine cone. Let's find the box with the gold and the transformers. What do we have? All right, looks like laundry. Laundry, laundry, this is all linens and stuff. Let's find another box. Yep, it's books. Oh, they're all the same too. Library of Nations. This one's so Asia, Arabian Peninsula. These are all Library of Nations books. I can see right down to the bottom. Let's get another one. This looks like Franklin Library books. So let's see what we have. A Coat of Varnish, CP Snow, Franklin Library. The Hill of Summer, first edition, Franklin Library. Elsa Morante, Franklin Library, first edition. Gunter Grass, The Meeting at Telg, Franklin Library. Bread Upon the Waters, The Bold and Magnificent Dream, first edition, Franklin Library. Beggarman Thief, first edition, Franklin Library. Potpourri, not from the Franklin Library. Kids Shell Collection, three more books. This one is Congo by Michael Crichton, first edition, Franklin Library. That's nice, maybe that's a keeper. That looks like a treasure. This is a treasure hunting book. Yeah. Uh, I've seen the movie, I haven't read the book, but now I think I should read the book. I'm gonna keep that and put that in my treasure collection because I'm the treasure collector. The Ghost Writer, Franklin Library, first edition. And one more, Jailbird. Well, that's a nice box full of books. Yeah. We'll uh, keep that. And let's go get another box. I found a treasure, I'm pretty happy. So let's see what the big room has for us. Hopefully it's a whole lot of more treasure. Uh, or just a bunch of personal papers, perhaps. Rotary Club, White Horse, Yukon. I'll, uh, I'll go through that a little bit more in detail and just make sure the million dollars in bonds stays with me. Yeah! Then I can make more of these fantastic videos. Is it a score of books? Mysteries of the Unexplained. I feel like that's a YouTube video. Yosemite, the American treasure. So lots of sort of old west kind of gold rush type books. And I'll grab this one. This one says toys. I'm a little bit excited. I'm trying to keep the, uh, the boxes that say toys aside so that my daughter can make a video. Come on, little spider. We're gonna save your life and just chuck you over here in the bush. Oh, this is the one with the transformer that I saw. Some kind of thing. There we have a helicopter. It's been painted. Here's the transformer that I saw earlier. That's uh, jet fire. I feel like that's generation one. Jetfire. I think that's worth about a hundred bucks on eBay. I'll double check that, but that's kind of cool. If it was Optimus Prime, I would keep it. If I stare at that long enough, I'll realize it's a sailboat. 
Ooh, is that a transformer? No, that's I feel like that's a GoBot or something. There's a half of a GI Joe. I think that guy's name is Wild Bill. I'll keep him aside in case I find the other half of him. Oh, there's another GI Joe, or is it? I don't know. He's kind of got the. Is that Mr. T? It looks like a bit like Mr. T. I don't know. There's a there's a canoe. What else do we have? Is that another GoBot right there? Wonder if the weapons for Jetfire are the other half of that GI Joe. There's the there's part of the GI Joe. Wild Bill. Now we just need his legs. Is that a Transformers? This is a Transformer. I think this is a Transformer. It's one of the Soundwave guys that goes in the Decepticon. I think that's a Decepticon. So there's two Transformers. Oh, a crab shell. Chuck that. Oh, is that a Transformer? This is maybe a Transformer. If it is, it's been played with a lot. I don't know if that's a Transformer or not, if it's just some a not Transformer. Oh, there's another Whoa. crab shell. Yuck. These are weapons for that Jetfire Transformer, so that's pretty handy. Looks like we'll have some of his weapons. That's a, that a GoBot maybe. Where's the other half of that G.I. Joe? Is that in here? I don't see the other half of uh, Wild Bill there. Oh, there it is there. We got Wild yeah. Bill's legs. That's perfect and they're not even loose. That goes with Jetfire, I think. And a little bit of Lego. Oh, what's in here? Packs for that. Feels like it's gonna go with uh, the Transformer guy. Blue's Leaker. Ooh, is that Wild Bill's backpack right there? Yeah. I'm gonna put it on him just in case. Let's get another box. This one also says toys. Maybe it's uh, all his quadruples of Storm Shadow and Snake yeah. Eyes and Optimus Prime oh, is what I think is in here. God. Well, it's toys. There's some Vaseline oh with doll legs and boots and things. That looks a bit like a Superman boot. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. What do we have there? A little doggy. Another little doggy. It's the, uh, it's the one that has, brings the rum and brandy yeah. to you. And what's this? That's another doggy. That's a magic bank. Is there money in it? No, there isn't. Expo 86 hat. Look at that. I had a pass to Expo 86. I went every day. Let's, uh, let's see, what do we have here? More toys, these are little McDonald toys. Oh, there's Miss Piggy and Zoot. Somebody was asking me if I find any Muppets to let her know, so I have found some Muppets now. Jetsons, Jetsons friend, oh, look at that. <coughs> I haven't seen the Jetsons in a long time. Kin that cometh to me will in no wise rasp out. Oh. Wow, well, okay, oh good font. Could have picked Times Roman font or something. There's some old balloons. And this is just little puzzle bits and light bright instructions. A few cups. And no kids toys are complete without matches. And there's a couple of sombreros. Brother and sombrero is four feet high. My daughter will uh, happily find all this stuff. Let's find it. Let's find another box. Yay! This one, this one's pretty light. So we'll grab that one too. I should stop getting my advice from Skeletor on Facebook. Christmas cards with not piles of cash in it. I'll have a look through this and make sure the million dollars in bonds is not there, but I'm not feeling like that's a winner of a box. I'm feeling like I'm gonna send that back to the owner. Either Oyster or Crystal. Let's find out, probably Crystal. Just a brandy glass or sherry glass or something. A little martini glass or something. Just a little glass. I don't feel like I even wanna open all the rest of these. It's like, the contents of their little bar. That's another one of these. This one feels like something different. Let's open it. Oh, it's a soup bowl. I wasn't very, what is that? It's for tea. Oh yeah, it's for tea. Yeah. So I have a little teapot, short and stout, and it is short and stout. So we'll just put that back straight into the garage and in then in the looked at it already pile. All right, what kind of clothes and books do we have? A towel. More towels and a big pile of, uh, I feel like these are kids' novels and stuff. Dutch's Hotspur. This is like 50s romance, yeah. like hot novels or something for single girl. Or is this what the boys read in the 50s? Doctor's Prejudice. The Marriage Wheel. Beware the Huntsman. Interesting. 
Okay, we'll just put all that back. And what do we have in here? A bunch of kitchen stuff. Doesn't say anything. Oh, yeah, it does. Shelves. Somebody's shelves. Let's see what's on their shelves. This is like teenager gear. And there's all the teenagers' headbands. And, you know, hockey goalie might wear that headband. Yeah. Looks 80s. And what do we have here? We have all the teenagers' belt collection. Glacier helicopters. Let's go get another box. Let's find out what is in the computer desk. Hopefully it's like a original Apple from the 1970s. Glasses, tell me the Gucci's are in there. Nope. Magazines, recycling. There's just one thing in here and it looks like some hanging basket. Macrame, is that what that is? Yeah. What is a macrame? You hang a basket in there, it's a basket hanger. Cool. Let's go find a new box. One, preferably one with jewelry and gold. Yeah! Some books and some dolls and things. Made in the USA. And that is a money jar. There's been a lot of these and they had money in them. Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen. Jane Austen, Mansfield Park. Pride and Prejudice, Jane Austen. This is like the kids elementary school book. Ruffles on my long john. Yeah. Oh, these are kind of old. The Fool Killer, The Clue of the Forgotten Murderer, Kenny em Kenyon Emma. These are kind of old. Songs of the Abbey, Conspiracy of the Carpenters, The Silver Ore, The Secret Garden. Where have I heard of that? Is that a is that a Netflix video or something? The Secret Garden, 1912. Wow. Oh. BF's Daughter. Wow. Oh. The Secret Garden, I think, is I feel like that I saw that on Netflix or something, maybe. The Eversley Secrets, American Captain by Edison Marshall. Essentials of Aviation Management. Confessions of an Immigrant's Daughter. A Thing of Beauty. The Trespassers. And Homeland. So let's find the good stuff. Hopefully it's in here. Some kind of goblet, maybe. Ooh, that's a little bit nice. Yeah. Look at that. That's not nice. it's a bowl. What do we have? Oh, look at this. It's a teapot. There's a teapot. Anybody need a teapot? I feel like it's a teapot. Ooh, that's a nice one. Another vase. Ooh, that's an old bottle. Fluid beer. There's an old liquor bottle in one of the other videos. It's a hundred year old one, so I got a hundred year old beer. Ooh, there's the matching uh, one of those. That's kind of nice. Ooh, I could put a rose in there. Yeah. Get back into the garage. Get another box, what do you say? All right, which one do we go first? This one here. All right, these are <coughs> not million dollar books. Okay, I don't know what any of these are, so I'm just gonna put them all back. Ooh, there's an antique looking book. The Rosary. Oh, that's pretty good, that's an antique book. Maybe that's worth something. Black Sand and Gold. Okay, so we got some uh, kind of frontier, pioneer kind of books. The Creek. Black sand and gold. I have been watching some prospectors from the Okanagan on YouTube, and uh, yeah, black sand is where the gold is. Dining room, it says on there. Pretty big honking a thing for a dining room. Tablecloth. Oh, look at this. It's a collector set of some kind. There's some antique silver. These are going to go in the treasure collection. Nabob. Wow, that's some pretty antique looking Nabob stuff right there. That's tarnished, so that's got to be some kind of silver plating or something. So there's some bunch of cutlery. Let's see what else do we have in here. China, made in China. Okay. What is that? I don't know. Looks cool. Light bulb recycling. Perfect. I feel like that's a little bit of gold wrapped around it. Made in something, I can't tell. There's another one. Ooh, that's got a little bit of gold plating on it. There's the serial number. Norataki. There's a salt pepper shaker thing. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty cute. That's kind of shiny. Ming Dynasty vase from 3,000 years ago. Oh, it is too. Look. Maybe it is. I feel like that's gold, maybe. Doesn't have a mark on it. Creamery bowl. That's the cream bowl. This is the sugar bowl. Let's open one and we'll just have a quick peek. It's a another 
tea set or something. Tea set, oh, very nice. 19 something, 1981. What happened in 1981? The empire struck back in 1981. It's Roman candles. Oh, they're just not Roman. I feel like this is the same kind of thing. Oh, rock glasses, Calgary. There's a plastic dish. Oh, here's some china, big crack in it. Royal Wessex, iron side, made by Swimmertons. Oh, there's a whole stack of that, wow. Wow, this is a bunch of china in here. This is gonna be hard to wrap up efficiently. What is that, a potato? It's salt. Oh, here's more. These things are kind of a bit special. Yeah! Pan with the number on it. What's this thing? It's a teacup. That seems quite special. That's a very yeah. nice teacup. I mean, a tea set. Oh, my grandparents had those exact same uh, glasses. What's that? Magnet. It's like, uh, is that a... Like yeah, that's what I was just thinking, vacuum filter. I sure do have lots of china now. Viking plate, silver plate. And there is like some kind of little metal holder thingy. It's a Pioneer salt shaker set. Oh, here's some more of these. There's the rest of this set. Oh, mushrooms, mushrooms, mushrooms. If I was a hobbit, I'd be all over oh my that. God. Wooden bowls, that's a pretty nice bowl. What does that say? Ming Dynasty, oh, perfect. We have it's from the Ming from the 1595. <laughs> Hang on. Nope. Okay, so this is just some kind of bowl. Tupperware. I've got the whole set of wooden bowls. I'm not even gonna open it. And that's it. The rest of this goes. This can all go back now. I wonder what that thing's worth. That could be worth like nothing or a thousand dollars. You know, who knows? If you know, leave a comment below and please subscribe while you're at it. I hope I've earned your... This is the cool stuff in here. Ooh, look at that one. That one's kind of shiny looking. Does it have a year? No. Here's my Sheffield English cutlery. Wow! We're gonna open that up. And here's the oh pieces I'm missing. God. So now we've recovered the roast poker and the last missing steak knife. The only thing remaining is this knife here. And then I'll have a complete English Sheffield cutlery set. Still in the box, MIB. Hopefully I've got that other knife somewhere in one of these boxes. Oh yeah, it's like probably in this box. All right, what do we have? Blossom time. So what's that? Ooh, that's lovely. That looks like it's gonna be expensive. Here's the rest of it. It's a China soup bowl, Royal Albert. I bet you that's like 50 to 100 bucks right there. Mashed potato bowl, Royal Albert, mint condition. We'll just have a look at a couple of these. Here's another one. Oh, there's the dinner plate settings. Okay, that's a shot glass for somebody who drinks a lot. It's a sherry glass, ice wine, champagne flute. So this is the other expensive china. I'm not gonna open this stuff because then I have to pack it back up and break it by accident. One more box, because it's fun. And this box has uh, Garfield. Yeah, ooh, there's a purse. Tell me there's money in it. There's a piece of wood. Let's open the purse, are you ready? garbage okay, is, uh, money 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 mostly pennies and nickels but whatever money's money we'll keep that Garfield is this a phone it's a Garfield phone look at that that's always nice finding finding money well let's just do one more box just because just because it's fun yeah! Got some more money, it's nice finding money. Too bad it's pennies. All right, this box is also fairly light. So let's see what's in this one. Ornaments. It's the Japanese Eiffel Tower maybe. A Berenstein Bear maybe. 
these Christmas ornaments. There's a little kitty, another kitty, a couple more kitties. Uh oh, there's an air raid. Take cover. There's Siamese, if you please. I am Siamese, if you please. Is this another Siamese, if you please? No, it's uh, it is. Look, it's that dog. What is that? Lady in the Tramp. There we go. Yeah. There's a little whale. It's a bunny. Seal. I feel like that's a clay thing somebody made. Another Lady in the Tramp dog, maybe. There's a little lampy lamp thing. And there's a little bunny in a bed. Broken zebra. And we have another bunny in a bed. Another, there's a little doggy. And there's a little Christmas kitty. And there's another Christmas kitty. And another Christmas kitty. And another little kitty. Oh, let's put all these away. Because that's really actually it for today. So the next video is going to be the last one for this storage locker. I'm going to be doing a lot more treasure hunting just because it's fun. And uh, so I hope you enjoyed the video. The next one for me will be tomorrow or whenever the rain stops for you. It's right now.